And topping our health cast today, uh, a study is underway into investigating a therapy that may provide treatment for mild to moderate Alzheimer's disease. The Lift Ad study is currently enrolling patients nationwide, including several sites right here in South Florida. It involves the use of an injectable drug that aims to protect and repair neurons in your brain. It's a medication uh, that is called Fosgonimitin, and Fosgonimitin is a medication that is uh, geared towards uh, really cellular signaling. So it really gets to um, the cellular pathways that we think may be involved. There may be uh, some um, characteristics of anti-inflammatory properties. Uh, there may be some neuroprotection involved. Um, and so uh, I think it's more getting at the multiple factors that play a role in the pathology of Alzheimer's disease. Dr. Jaramillo says that current therapies only address the symptoms of early to moderate disease, not the actual underlying causes. To learn more about this study, look for this story uh, on our website, local10.com. And a recent report found that stroke deaths could jump 50% around the globe by the year 2050. This according to the World Health Organization. In 2020, there were 6.6 .6 million deaths, but that number is projected to hit 9.7 million by 2050 if steps are not taken to address the problems. 91% of the projected deaths will happen in low to middle income countries.